What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having a great day. Guys, this is my interior design of my Dunkin' Donuts speed build. Listen, I recorded this video. So I had recorded this video the same time I did my Dunkin' Donuts Baskin Robbins speed build a month ago. I released that video, the exterior building and decorating of the outside. That video on May 16th. It's it's a month. A month and a few days later. I'm just now recording the audio for this video and getting it all set up. Oh my gosh. And then the other day when I was actually like getting everything set up. I was going to take a picture of the, for the thumbnail. And I realized I didn't save anything for from the inside. So I had to take... <laughs> oh my gosh so I literally the thumbnail has nothing Ugh, I can't even speak the thumbnail is basically like one of my coffee shops that I created and I kind of made it like a, a Dunkin Donuts themed coffee shop does nothing like that room is not even in this build so that's what that is my neglect right there but anyways, guys, this stuff pack that I'm using is called the Duncan Brands Stuff Pack. It is a fan-made pack by Oh My Sims, and it has Dunkin' Donuts and a Baskin-Robbins stuff. Everything is pretty much just stagnant um, for decoration. It looks amazing, though. Everything is very high quality, so it fits in more with a alpha build, but it can go for Max's Match as well. It also comes with a lot of outfits four out sorry four outfits and a couple of hats both dunkin donuts and baskin robbins so and i will probably make a kind of overview like a stuff pack overview of this pack just because i do love it so much i kind of want to do like a coffee shop or even an ice cream shop based on this in one of my worlds as well and I promise it won't take me another month to get that review video out. But with Island Living coming out, what, in a day? You just never know. You never know what's going to happen. Island Living is going to take up a lot of my time. I have so much content for that. But this video isn't about Island Living. It's not even beach related. This is about Dunkin' Donuts and Baskin Robbins. So I definitely wanted to make everything kind of look a little bit busy. I wanted to add stuff to the shelves. This was the hardest part because I had to place everything very carefully, had to make it look, not like make it look cluttered, but make the clutter look like it needed to be there. So I was a little, I'm not going to lie, like I was a little shocked that you couldn't use any of the stuff like to order ice cream or, you know, get ice cream from something. Definitely with the with the pack that added ice cream with the ice cream maker and everything It would have been super nice if we had something like the when you go to an ice cream shop Like you see right now where they have just the ice creams in a row and you can go and get Cones or a, a cup of something like that would be amazing to have and I really think that they should incorporate something into the Sims 4 um, it would have been cool if this pack could do it too but i think that's a lot of coding that you know you just don't have time for so right here i actually do a table for all of the ice cream um toppings the chocolates and stuff like that i added a little dispenser right there and then i just put all the nuts all the um danishes cookies things that you want to put on your ice cream maybe your coffee you just never know how people roll i was listen like i was super excited about this pack i was surprised with everything that it brought it brings a lot of stuff and this is the only when i was doing when i was building this this was the only cc that i had in my game so it has a lot of stuff even though you can't use any of the stuff except for the clothing it was still pretty cool. Everything is very high quality. Um, all of the posters come in either English or Simlish. I chose Simlish just because it fits in more with the aesthetic. I know that a lot of clothes that I have for my Sims or a lot of other signs are will be in English. But I felt like for this, since we're playing The Sims 4, this fits in pretty well too. 
So when I was actually decorating the inside and kind of putting it all together, I realized just how much room I didn't have. Like I made this into a super small cramped space. I didn't want anything too big because I don't like building a lot of bigger stuff. The biggest thing I had a problem was was the bathrooms. I made those bathrooms super tiny, which was fine. I always, when I'm building stuff, I always forget about bathrooms. I never make enough space for them. So I kind of had to make space in the middle. And one of the things when I'm putting these posters, I love these pictures. They're so good. I definitely want to make like a Dunkin' Donuts cafe or something for one of my builds. I would love to make a Starbucks too. Like and that's the thing about Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks. Starbucks is very dark, kind of more um, artsy, while Dunkin' Donuts is just, it's brighter, it has brighter colors. They're just a total, it's just a total different vibe. And listen, like Dunkin' Donuts, a lot of people prefer Starbucks over Dunkin' Donuts when it comes to coffee, but Dunkin' Donuts has some good coffee now, and this is coming from someone who loves Starbucks. But I, anytime, like in my town, we have both Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks. Those are like the two main chain coffee shops that we have. But um, usually our Starbucks is packed all the time. So I'll go to Dunkin' Donuts and get a large iced coffee for $2 and some change. When if I went to Starbucks, um, it would be like $5 for a specialty drink. And even in Dunkin' Donuts, like their largest is is a lot bigger than the venti at um starbucks so <laughs> so i wanted to make this seating area bright fun i wanted to bring all the colors from basket robbins and dunkin donuts both together kind of combined it um that's why with the tables they look they're glass top i don't like looking back now i don't know why i did make them glass top but oh well um, but with the chairs, I wanted to give them that different color vibe because, you know, uh, Baskin Robbins is more blue while Dunkin' Donuts has the orange and pink. Kind of just make it a fun place for like teens to hang out, young adults, just something cool like that as well. And I'm actually so upset that I didn't save this so I can do a good thumbnail. Like the thumbnail is not bad, but it's not what I made. I'm so upset because this is beautiful. And I would have definitely took a picture of the ice cream and the donut, basically the kitchen all together for a better thumbnail for this video. But <laughs> you get what you get. But yes, guys, sorry it took so long to get this video released. Uh, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please give it a like, please subscribe, please give it a comment. Tell me what you liked the most out of this. And if you really like this pack, I will see you guys again later. Thank you so much. I will see you next time on Island Living. Bye, guys.